Hello everyone, this is Fire and this is the Elves Box. This is actually my first Elves Box. This is February's and Luna's everywhere. <laughs> so, last year I actually tried getting February's Elves Box, which is their anniversary box. And I accidentally bought a gift card for their store. So, my friend Sunny helped me get this one this year. It's a little bit crushed from the back, so I won't be reusing it, but it got here. Let's see. It said that it shipped on the 2nd, so it probably took two weeks to get here. I don't remember what today is. Maybe a week and a half, but it felt like it took forever. So, let's open up and see what it looks like, and I'm using my webcam because I misplaced my tablet. So, I'm hoping some of the colors pick up. So, let's see. Luna, stop biting me! This would actually be my first craft box, and I love doing crafts. I'm a craft hoarder, so this would be fun to do. Let's see. So, let's open it up. What does it look like? Oh, they do have their risen and stuff in here. I remember them saying that this is edible. Like, if your pets try to eat it, it would be safe for them. So, Luna! I don't want her to eat it. I just want her to stop biting me and playing with my other stuff. Here. Play with that. She actually bit off my headphones the other day. So, this is what we have. They said the anniversary box has, like, a bunch of their stuff is, like, super overloaded with awesome things. Let's see. This is Sophie and Toffee's card, if you can read it. Probably not. So let's see. It has their website. Win a free February box for creativity. This is the blow-up box. Accessories of items. We have the 2 part 2 resin, which, if you look inside, it looks like one of them might have leaked. But that's fine, because I can just wipe it off. It is packaged nicely. Then we have 20 bezels, which are these. And I've seen some of their bezels in their store. And once I use that gift card, I'll probably buy some more. Some of these are super cute. So, we have a cat. Oh no, here. <laughs> a cute unicorn. These are a little bit bigger than I thought. These are cool. They're like an inch and a half. Yeah, they're about an inch and a half. We have this one, which I thought was really cool. We have a heart with wings. We have a castle with stars we have another horse pony we have a carousel we have another cat we have the strawberry shortcake house and we have a magic wand alright the next item if I love this package let's see they put these on Facebook. These are their glow-in-the-dark charms. Aren't they super cute? Other than the fact that they're made from resin and they're pretty big. You have some pink moons, clouds, stars, and some blue ones. I very much doubt I can do the glow-in-the-dark thing on this camera. Let's see. We have 12 tier charms. Oh wait, I found more bezels. One, two, three. Yeah. So it looks like they gave us silver and gold. They're the same things as this one. These are the tear uh, teardrops. 
They're made from glass. They have a watercolor design inside. Oh, they look like they're made from glass. Oh, found them in. Now, I've never used, I haven't used none of Sophie and Toffee stuff. And their resin is supposed to be, like what? This one isn't that flashlight resin. So I guess it's regular resin. Because it's a part A and part B kind. Cures within 6 to 12 hours. Has less bubbles and are for uh, smaller projects. The only resin that I ever used was Easy Cast. And I didn't even know resin kind of expired until I heard someone else say it did. <laughs> so, some of my resin probably did expire this whole time. Especially the one that I had open. It like has encrusted on top. But oh well. So, then we have these clear bubble charms. These are plastic. Let's see. These are... Yep. Plastic clear ball charms. No Luna. You cannot fit in that box. Of course she's going to try. Let's see. Then we have these. They also posted these on their Facebook. This one is like a candy charm. It actually has like... Oh, it is plastic. How can I open this? I didn't know it was going to be like plastic plastic. I thought it was made out of resin. So if I wanted to, I can take this heart out. This is a plastic charm. It has a little hole on top though. And there's a few goldfish bags in here. Which is pretty cool. Oh, I thought we were going to get more though. So, did we only get three? Yep. There are three sweet charms. That's what they're called. Then we have two silicone molds. Oh, these are much smaller than I thought they would be. This one is their gumball machine um, silicone mold. This is the one that they use for, oh, I forgot, Shake'ems? I forgot what they called them. And then you have this one. Can you see it? You can see it kind of. It's like a gypsy, it's like a ball. And then we have two more things in here left. Is that everything? I wonder what their regular boxes are since this one's the blowout one. There we have two gem accents. We have, let's see, this one has risen, some metal pieces. And rhinestones. Did I say that? Rhinestones and metal pieces. Oh wow. So pretty much both of them are just mixed with little goodies inside. This one has like micro marbles and some metals and some gold pieces. And this one doesn't have micro marbles, but it has some really cool stuff in it. And that's it that's in this box. So we got everything. I wonder what I can make with these. Yay! <laughs> so I wonder what their other stuff would be. The next box is called Sakura. And the Sakura box is going to have their... What is it? Their first... Um, jewelry box, and we got um, real flowers and stuff that you can put with it. 
So I'm going to try my best and do a craft later on. Thank you for watching the unboxing and stay random and I'll see you next time. Hopefully with a better video <laughs> or video projection. Mm -hmm. Bye.